Begin today with a man who jumped into action to save lives during the shooting at a gay nightclub in Colorado. That's what I, I, I was trained to do. I saw him and I went and got him. And I'm beating this guy. This guy's trying to wiggle. He's trying to get his, his ammo, his guns. I needed to save my family. And that family was, at that time, everybody in that room. Army veteran Richard Fierro is credited with helping stop the shooter who killed five people over the weekend in Colorado Springs. And today, his parents who live in Escondido opened up about their son's actions. We have different cultures, we have different ethnicities, we have different beliefs, but that's America. And that's what my son fought for. Our Phil Blower is standing by with the latest on the investigation into the shooting. But first, our Jamie Chambers starts us off live from Escondido with what else Fierro's parents are saying today. Jamie. Yeah, the Fierro family as a whole has dedicated their lives to the service of the United States. But Richard Fierro Sr. says that if violence ever broke out, his son is exactly the person you'd want sitting next to you. He kicked the rifle and told other people to get that rifle out of there. And he, at the same time he was doing that, he picked up the guy's handgun. And I don't know if it dropped or he took it from his holster. I don't know that. But he got the gun and he just started hitting him in the face with it. This man was much larger than him. My son's large. In a calculated counterattack, the former Army major was beyond rage. He said I could have killed him and I would have killed him. Except the former Army combat vet, Richard Fierro, knew that he had to stop the bleeding in the victims around him. Then he went to go look for his family. He was soaked in blood. Soaked in blood from all the carnage that was in the room. Richard Fierro Jr., known as Rich, played football at Mira Mesa and spent 15 years as an Army officer serving his country. And Richard Fierro Sr. says the family had gone to Club Q to support a high school friend of his daughter's who was performing a drag show. The Fierro family losing their granddaughter's boyfriend in the shooting is outraged with the violence. People all bleed the same. We're all the same. We're not any different. Yes, we have different cultures, we have different ethnicities, we have different beliefs. But that's America. And that's what my son fought for. And my husband to give us liberty. There is little doubt Rich Fierro saved countless lives that night and his parents are overwhelmed with his bravery and at the same time not surprised by his actions. He was born their Superman. We're extremely proud of him. But it's hard to be proud in this kind of situation. Francis and Richard Sr. had planned to go to Texas to celebrate Thanksgiving. Now they've changed their plans. They're heading to Colorado Springs to support their son and the surrounding community. That's the very latest from Escondido, Jamie Chambers. Fox 5 News. Yeah, I understand.